I just I just did my part. Uh, you got the yeah! two quarters, just a little, just a little some of that. The two quarters. Yeah, they're getting into it. Uh, oh wow! Just starting off with a grab. <laughs> Gatsby trying to just land the up tilt at the very start of the game to kill. Oh my god. Oh, oh. What the? Oh, Falcon have a jump. He does not. Oh, not actually able to punish that high up E. Uncharacteristic oh. from Quid. And oh, okay. Okay, so here's the thing. We talk about how Falcon should just get bodied, but on the other hand, so when, sometimes this Falcon does the stuff. Yeah. And when the he does happens. the stuff, it matchups be damned, you know? Yeah. Ugh. And there Ugh. we go. Stuff got done. Yeah. Ooh. Wow, that was... Oh, no. That's going to be kill. Yes. Oh, what? No. No. Squirtle does not. I think his forward smash is too slow to punish mm. in that situation, and down smash just didn't have enough kill power at that point. Yeah, I've, I've seen that jab block kill so oh, many up times. Up air but kill. What? What? I have what? never seen Squirtle up air kill. What? That must have been some absolutely suspicious DI. But then again, why would you DI to survive against Squirtle up air? The move doesn't kill. I guess it does. <laughs> but only if you don't DI for it. But why would you ever DI for it? Because it never kills. <laughs> what? No way. No. Okay. Okay. What was that? Okay. Never mind. Squirtle can do all the smash attacks from jab locks. But I guess at that point he wanted the angle from down smash. Oh. Ugh. Ugh. That that looked painful. Just a uh, falcon kick, just killing from the top there. Oh my, no, what? <gasps> oh, oh, no, Gatsby. Gatsby already dealing 51. Uh, not only that, like this is the thing. When the Falcon is feeling himself, he just, oh God, it's a horror. It's a horrifying thing that oh. no man should be subject to. I, I think Gatsby a li overestimated uh, Raptor boost just a little bit. Or wait, no, not Raptor Boost. The uh, wait, I don't remember. Falcon Dive, yes. Uh, Falcon Dive. Why are you doing that? No, hold on a second, Gatsby. You have a massive lead here to work with. Why would you put yourself willingly off stage? I, I understand. I mean, I understand the why, but how could you? <laughs> He's feeling himself. That's true. If he if he had been like. If he had been a timid little sheep this entire time, he wouldn't be where he is taking game one. That was less than three minutes. That was very quick. Wow. All right. So I think that if you're quid, you kind of got to clean up the disadvantage state. Yeah, that was... And, and sometimes that just means don't get hit by the 50-50. Flip your coins right. Yeah, just flip your coin better, bro. Yeah, come on. And Gatsby was getting some crazy techs this game. Like, that one tech off the side oh, yeah. was crucial to keep that momentum. I mean, momentum. when you're a good Falcon player, you kind of have to be good at teching. That's true. Also, I remember how you said something about hot sauce before commentating. Let me just quickly... Are you actually gonna do take some hot sauce right now? You're friggin' loon. I have right here from Buffalo Wild Wings a cup of blazing sauce, which is made with Carolina Reapers. I will not drink the whole thing because I want to save some for later, but <laughs> is that Ghost Devin or is that on air Devin? Oh. <laughs> uh, I, I swear, guys, we're laughing for a good reason. Oh my. Oh. oh. 
Just also just really smart punishing out of shield with the uh, with the up B there, but that that shield isn't existent. He's not able to shield for at least like ten seconds. Yeah. But I mean, if you get in combo, oh! you don't need a shield. If you get hit by the knee, then your shield regenerates automatically. Yeah. <laughs> it was a tactical dead. stock ah! Also, okay, <laughs> that was quick. The immediate response, no time for Gatsby to get anything going, which is honestly, I feel like it's less important that Gatsby gets like extra credit than he does extra feeling, you know? Yes, like if he, get, if he has a stock lead and then he gets to keep doing what he wants, that's when things can get uh, horrifying. Whoa, just a stomp to just stop that uppy from hitting. That was bananas. Oh, there. Oh, okay. Kept the that jump just barely. Yep. But already losing the stock. This went from a lead in Gatsby's favor to Quid having just a strong lead here. Lapping him in percent in an instant. Yeah. In a matter of seconds, it's already a stock lead. Okay, I like the idea behind that up B, but Quid is definitely wise to it. And again, has forced up B high because of the threat of that Ivy Sword down air. Quid just can wait and react. What's the mix up there? Is the mix up just like aggressively fast falling to the ledge? Did he have his jump here? He just used it and he can't do anything now because he was in free fall. Yeah. No, I mean before that, like in, when you're that high in that situation. No, uh, no, he used he double jumped right into. I know, I'm saying so before the double jump. Oh, so he's oh. over here, and because he made the decision to high up B at the same time he double jumped. Yeah. Right. So, I mean, he also maybe could have drifted back towards the stage, back towards the ledge. Ready? Mm. Yeah. Just don't go into free fall, five head. Against other characters, it's maybe not that bad of a call because, you know, Falcon is very heavy and a fast fall or hard to kill off the top. But Ivysaur, killing yeah. off the top is like... <laughs> You're either going up or down with Ivysaur. <laughs> or off the side. Honestly, Ivysaur just kills you. Yes, Ivysaur just has a, a bomb. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. I, okay, I, I like the mix-up of now air dodging um granted i like the mix up i don't love it because he's still taking 95 percent and hasn't managed to get out of the corner this is ugh, this yeah, corner was, pressure yeah all right so i was saying before how like oh you know quid needs to clean up his disadvantage a little bit no it seems like he's just gonna clean up his own advantage state that's that's the solution yeah these are two players that just have very strong advantage states mm. ah! no way i felt that in my soul All that fear oh, of the man. up air and down air. Not enough of that forward smash. <laughs> you feared the wrong thing. Okay, again, going for that up B, but Quid has... Oh. It feels like he's just been playing around it every time. And at this point, look at this damage being dealt. Oh, never mind. What an aggressive interception. Ooh. Oh. This is a big opportunity here to deal a lot of damage. <gasps> oh, oh, the oh, F2 oh. so clutch, just coming in quick enough. And now that situation, which could have honestly left, led to Quid's death. He had a, well, he had control for a little bit. Now they're trading back and forth here, but this might be it. No, we're going to go back throw instead. Oh, is that going to, oh, yeah. that hurts. Just right. when you think you made it back. Look at these combos, 56%, and it is still growing. Oh no. And, oh no. Oh, every option that he's going for just catches the landing in the end. That's gonna be going up 2-1. You know, this set started off really good for uh, for Gatsby. It yeah. felt like he had a lot of momentum. It felt like he was doing what he wanted to do. Uh, but after being put through the, the blender, <laughs> after being just, like, juiced for the last, like, th 
five minutes. It seems like that uh, that devil may care attitude is starting to uh, wear a little thin. Mm hmm. Ready? Ugh, that was. Ugh. Wow. <laughs> Quid is just so dominant now. Went from losing with like Gatsby just running over them to just being the one running over saying, okay, I'm out of the hospital. Now get on the road. <laughs> oh, my favorite song in Smash. Love this. Oh, but <laughs> that was just 10 seconds of them trying to hit each other and no one getting. Well, and then after that, it was 10 seconds of Gatsby just getting hit. <laughs> oh, All right. no. Oh, F tilt to up B. Really cool stuff from Quid. Uh, I think he's probably looking for, like, throw, get Gatsby off stage and then switch to Ivy Sword. Oh, boy. Oh. Oh, the clutch of some switches. <laughs> okay, here's the thing. I agree with it because there is no better palate cleanser than suicide down everything on a on, on, on a fool. Oh, oh. If that had hit on the platform, there is no surviving that. Oh? Wait, did I? Oh, I received... <laughs> <laughs> we got a, we got some dick subs from Looney to die. But also, Gatsby's sort of just gifting these stocks to Quid right now. I mean, look, it's, it's such a massive lead. Never mind. It's only a stock lead. Gatsby could do this. Oh. I mean, there's always... This is the thing. Falcon, it feels like he always has a win condition. It's just that his win condition is... Is is just being a nut. <laughs> Speaking of nuts. Oh my god. Just <laughs> there's that sound, that Falcon punch. You know, it you gotta you gotta hear it at least once per Falcon set. And I mean if it had landed it yeah. didn't matter what Quid does. Quid could have you know taken his last stock and he still would have lost the set. Yeah. So I can it's it's basically a all or nothing. Unfortunately, he kind of was left with nothing, and at this point, Quid is... Oh! Mm. Mm. Not so soon. All right, can it be... We have... Uh, yeah, we saw... We've seen no Chars on this set. Just yeah. not bothering with it at all. And that's going to oh, no, that's tech, and there's no way he's living that. Yep. Yeah. That time, we do, in fact, see Squirtle go for the forward smash. Going to be taking the set 3-1. Quid going to be moving on in winners, facing off against Jonathan in winners finals. Wow, that was a completely different story from Jonathan G versus Laird. Like, Quid dropped that first game, and then it's just like, all right, all right, all right. And now he will try. <laughs> all, right. all right. Thank you guys so much for tuning in here to Xeno Wi Fi 61. If y'all haven't, which I know some of you haven't, I'm not going to name names here, but that's only because I don't have the means to. I'm sure Devin could. Devin could start naming names if he wanted to. On of air. those yes, who I have can. not done the match yes. arena. We, we, we can go look at the Hall of Fame and, and realize anyone who's not on it is on the Hall of Shame. Let's uh, let's take a look real quick. Here we go. So we're going to go to the Match Arena page. You get, you get here by uh, going to exclamation point Match Arena. Super easy. I'll type it in the chat for you. So you don't even have to do that. Once you're here, you'll sign in at the top. You just sign in with any of your existing accounts, and you're good to go. You just, you boom, you're in. You've made an account. And mm -hmm. then you'll hit Contribute, and then when you hit Contribute, you'll see a coupon code uh, section, and it says, enter your coupon code. And you're just like, XW61, and boom, you add 50 cents for free. 50 cents for free. Wow. There's also some sponsor quests if you want to add some more money to the prize pool for free. Which is follow Matcherino on Twitter for 30 cents. Follow him on Met on uh, Twitch for another 30 cents. Retweet uh, one of their tweets for 30 cents. 
wow, that's already 90 cents plus 50 cents. And you already got like a dollar 40 going. You're, you're, you're sitting pretty. You get, uh, just mm -hmm. made of free cash. Um, then just some free. other ones. And uh, yeah, so let, let's go check out the uh, the contributions list. Here's the, the, the list of extraordinary gentlemen and women. Uh, we got Salty Fun and Peter at the top. Very nice. Thank you for your <laughs> That's a whole dollar from our commentary. Let's go. I'm going to not use my real, my Google account next time because it has my real <laughs> human name. Your human <laughs> name. Duly as noted. Close, as opposed your to your Yoshi human name. name. Uh, we got Louis Jesus. We got... We got Jane, we got Josh Thin, or I guess now Jonathan. We gotta update that, I guess, somewhere. Sweet Lou Laird, Sweet Lou with the sponsor quest as well. We got the $20 donation direct from UBL, bless. Wow. Uh, you know, so like, UBL giving us a little bit of that UBI. And, <laughs> yes. <laughs> what, what, UBI, what? But, uh, yeah. Universal basic income. We're, uh, oh. Our goal, <laughs> our first goal, our first milestone that we want to hit is $35. That helps us achieve top three payout for tonight. So if you're uh, if you're not on this list, go just go do the match Reno. It's free. It's easy. And then uh, you and then if you're participating in these brackets, you know, be sure to hit the the join tournament button if you ever make it to payout. So then we can pay we we can pay you. So. Uh, yeah, so definitely go through and do that. Go, go, go. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. I need to add go, go, go to one of my buttons. That's a that's a good one. The baby daisy also, go, go, go. I've got the hot sauce right here. All right. I'm gonna dip see, a finger let's, in. Let's see the hot. Let's see the hot sauce. I've got right. a dog. I'm gonna yeah. dip a finger in. Oh man. Look at that red. Yeah. Pretty good. You know what that's made of? Carolina Reaper. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Um, with that said, let's get into winners' finals, which is going to be Jonathan versus Quid. So, back to off air for me. All right. I was trying to get my dog to come up on my lap, but he didn't want to because he doesn't love me. He loves me. My dog loves getting on laps. Oh, no. normally he does too, but I think he's just a little too tired. Yeah. Just I feel sad. that. What a 